Corp and Ramirez, and today I'm going to be showing you how badly the Rubik's brand sucks. Now, I today I made a video on reviewing the uh, Guan, the uh, the Fontex Guan Long, and it's actually pretty good. I recommend you go buy it. And and I say if we if like like to like the video so I can make a video. <laughs> so many videos. So like the video so I can make a video on how badly the Rubik's brand sucks. Now this was my second Rubik's cube. This one is actually my first one, but this piece is actually broken. I just glued it on there so I don't lose the piece, the corner piece. So yeah, let's get straight into this. So obviously we're gonna start it off with the corner cutting. If we're gonna like, yeah, sucks. Really sucks. Now that didn't happen. That happened because like I was doing that. Yeah. So corner cutting, not so good. Um, some turns. No, obviously, obviously, if you add uh, lubricant into this, it would probably be better. But since I don't have lube, um, I'm obviously, I'm obviously poor. So, but anyways, the turning is, um, turning crap. The sticker quality is a, uh, it's okay, but I wouldn't say it's. 10 out of 10, but the sticker quality is okay, but these are more like tiles, because obviously Rubik's.com, they they suck, I recommend you go buy from Speed Cube Shop, and yeah, so I'm going to do a solve on this, just mix it up, I, once again I will be recording the uh, desktop, now obviously you can't you can't twist the corners. All right. All right. All right. All right. So I got it. Let me just set up the timer. No, actually, let me start recording first. So add fifteen time inspection. Inspection. Okay. So uh, for space. All right. Ready. Steady. Go. All right, sorry for not talking, just concentrating. Turning speed is obviously crap. Alright, so what was the algorithm for this? Alright, so this obviously needs to go here. Alright, so um, let's see. 
on it, so. Alright, so, got that. Yeah. Alright, so t the speed on this was, so I was able to solve it in 2 minutes and 40, sec 40 seconds. So the result of that is, obviously, um, obviously, don't buy it because it sucks. So, yeah. So, this is how badly the Rubik's brand sucks. I, I don't recommend you buy it. I recommend I recommend you buying like these kind of cubes from Speed Cube Shop. Alright, so, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, smack that like button, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace out. Tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me pretty lies Look me in the face, tell me that you love me